Welcome to a very unplanned, unscripted episode of Cooking on the Fry. This is what happens when you microwave a prime rib. I didn't mean to do this. I actually wanted to eat it. I did my usual bring it up to room temperature thing in the microwave. Only instead of putting it in for 4 minutes at 20%, I accidentally put it in for 4 minutes at 100% and it cooked much of the way. I ended up leaving it in there another six minutes at about 50 percent so that the liquids didn't just start boiling and splattering all over the inside of the microwave. And I was kind of going to do this for fun someday anyway just to see what happened to a nice piece of steak if you threw it in the microwave. I'm only at about four dollars and Hopefully I'll have a video and this has been out of the microwave for three or four minutes and as you might be able to see the internal temperature is at 163 so it's done. I wonder what's in there. Let's find out. Yummy. Let's see how it tastes. I should have waited for the yummy, right? Well, it actually is edible, not by much. I've destroyed much of the uh, steak flavor. I don't know if uh, I didn't know in advance that it was prime rib, if I'd be able to tell it was prime rib. I think it's safe to eat, and I am rather hungry. So, I'm going to have a little more of this, but I'm not going to do it again. So, I'm going to sign off on the shortest cooking on the fry episode probably ever, which didn't happen on the fry. It happened in the microwave. But if you ever wanted to know what happens if you microwave a good steak, well, now you know.